Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Pavlov Shack map guide. Today we're going over Siberia. Let's get into this. So our first spot here is going to be in this room with the shelves and you're going to walk up this staircase and you're going to peek out of the window with the bars right here. And this is a very nasty spot. If the enemy team is coming around that corner right there, they really can't see you. So this is what it looks like if you're coming into the room and somebody's peeking from right there, you're not going to expect it. And it's a really nasty spot. One of the best spots in the entire map. Our second spot is actually right beside the window. You're going to peek this window right here and watch to the right there. Because the enemy team could come from right there or they could come from up top. You have a nice little angle on them through mid. It's a nice and cheeky spot. They won't expect it because usually they will expect you to be, you know, peeking the doorway trying to shoot, you know, with your whole body exposed. But not through the window. It's a nasty spot. So spot number three is actually going to be under this staircase. It's not really a good angle per se, but it is a good hiding spot if you are the last on your team and the whole team is searching for you. So like you're in a 1v5 situation, they really won't expect you to be sitting under this staircase and you can get some nice easy kills, maybe one or two kills that could save the round. So I would just use it as a backup hiding spot. If you're, if you're down, your whole team's down and you're the last one here, definitely hide right here. It's a good spot. Same thing with this staircase right here, but it's just not as good as the spot over there. It's more exposed. Also, if you turn around and look around, this corner right here is actually pretty dirty. It's a nice camping spot. They really can't get you from this spot. So these are nice little hiding spots, but not really good angles. Just thought I would throw that in there. So our fourth spot is actually going to be back over by the staircase. You're going to walk up the staircase, but you're not going to go all the way up like this. You're going to stay on the staircase and you're going to peek over this little pillar right here. And it's going to make for a nasty spot because your head is pretty much the only thing showing. Maybe a little bit of your right side showing. But other than that, you can get a headshot through that window because that window is where a lot of people like to camp. Same thing on to A site. If any enemies are coming through A, you can get a nice shot off on them. So our fifth spot is on this side. And if if you spawn it on this side and you're trying to defend a usually if the enemy is coming a they're going to run up that staircase over there so you're going to run over here in this corner and you'll be protected from the staircase and you can actually keep a watch on the site it's a nice little spot if their whole team is pushing a and you need to defend it somehow because this whole area is exposed you need some type of cover now our sixth spot is going to be right here same thing if you're trying to watch a you're defending a come right here and peek through the crack and it's way less noticeable than the window up there which i'll show you in a minute you come right here and you peek you can get a sight on the a pretty nasty spot it's way better than just coming out with your body and you know peeking your whole body out you'll get shot but if you're back here it's way less noticeable Another nice angle by our sixth spot is actually these windows right here. If you're on the attacking side and the defenders are camping upstairs, you can peek through these windows right here and you can pop them right in the head. And it's way less predictable than coming in the door and trying to kill them because you can get easily headshot. Make sure you use these windows you can get some nice kills. So I'm going to just count these two windows as the seventh spot. Everybody knows these two windows. It's pretty much like the most overused camping spot in this map. But these windows right here, you can peek on the stairs, get a sight into the defending team spawn. But usually, you'll only be in this room if you are defending. And also this window right here, which keeps an eye onto pretty much almost the entire balcony area over here by the attacking side spawn. Just thought I'd throw that in there because maybe if you're new to the game, you don't know you know about these windows make sure you use these windows they're really good so our eighth spot i don't see very many people using this but it is a great spot it can be good in some circumstances especially if you're the last person left come over by these rocks and kind of just head head glitch it you know peek out get some shots off especially if they're camping upstairs you can uh, get them through the window right here it's a nice little spot that not many people use the ninth spot is actually going to be this room right here i don't see very many people going in here um it's actually great because these windows can defend you from a lot of fire especially if you're defending it can defend you from the door right there or you know right side you got these walls right here that are going to protect fire so you can take cover then peek out pop them peek out pop them it's not the best angle, but it is it is a good spot that isn't used very much. So our ninth spot is actually going to be the entire upstairs jail cells. These are pretty much like everybody uses these. This is like the dirtiest camping tactic in this map. And this is why actually this is the reason that I hate this map. 
or all these jail cells, man, they're so unnecessary. And you can peek on the site like this. And it's just like the dirtiest camping spot in the entire game. Kind of corny. I don't recommend you use it because, like I said, it's corny. I don't like it. But if you come in here, peek through the windows, you can see a lot. Plus, you're on the B site. You can peek on B site. You're a pussy if you camp in the jail cells. And our final spot is going to be back in the room with the shelves. Come upstairs by the window, our first spot. And it's going to be this little room right here. And this, the reason I put it on here last is because it's kind of obvious. A lot of people come up here. But you can see onto the entire B site, get some nice peeks. Both sides can come in this room and get this spot. So it's pretty much a universal spot everybody can come over here and you can use these pillars right here for cover if you need them and crouch down which can provide cover as well make sure you guys subscribe to join the 1k club and also let me know what you think of these spots and angles down below in the comments anyways guys peace out